In a discovery that has added a new layer of intrigue to an already mysterious location, Chinese radar has detected a massive plasma bubble hovering over the pyramids of Giza, an atmospheric phenomenon that has both scientists and mystery seekers paying close attention. While equatorial plasma bubbles are not uncommon in this region of the world, what makes this event extraordinary is how and from where it was observed. The detection did not come from space or a nearby ground station in North Africa, but rather from the island of Hainan in the South China Sea, nearly 8,000 kilometers away. This remarkable feat was made possible through China's cutting-edge low-latitude long-range ionospheric radar, or LARID, and has raised questions not just about atmospheric science, but about the growing number of unusual events being recorded above the ancient pyramids. Plasma bubbles, also known as equatorial plasma bubbles, are massive irregularities in the Earth's ionosphere. They form as giant voids of plasma density, stretching hundreds of kilometers across, and typically occur after sunset near the equator. These phenomena can interfere with communication and navigation systems, but they are generally well understood and tracked via space-based or local ground-based observations. However, the low-latitude long-range ionospheric radar's recent detection of one such bubble over Giza, at a distance of nearly 5,000 miles, represents a major leap in observational capability and has reignited conversations about the mysterious and often misunderstood environment above ancient sites like the Great Pyramids. This detection is not merely a technological triumph, but a captivating scientific mystery. The bubble was spotted in real time from across the globe, a feat made possible through LARID's innovative use of radio waves that bounce off the ionosphere and return to the radar array. Much like how long-distance radio broadcasts are transmitted, LARID sends radar signals into the atmosphere where they interact with ionospheric anomalies such as plasma bubbles. The return signals then paint a picture of the disturbance, even if it's happening half a world away. The radar's range has increased dramatically in recent months, from roughly 3,200 kilometers to over 9,600 kilometers, or 5,900 miles, allowing researchers to capture ionospheric events on a truly global scale. While the formation of a plasma bubble over Egypt isn't unprecedented, the timing and location of this particular observation are capturing attention for other reasons. In recent months, several other unusual discoveries have been made in and around the Giza Plateau. Hidden voids inside the Great Pyramid, deep anomalies detected beneath its base, and unexplained electromagnetic activity recorded near the Sphinx have all contributed to a growing sense that something is stirring, something not yet fully understood. The detection of a plasma bubble by Chinese radar now joins this growing list of anomalies. Though scientists are cautious in making any speculative connections, the convergence of multiple unusual phenomena in the same location is hard to ignore. The fact that this massive bubble was not only present, but detectable in real time from a radar system thousands of kilometers away elevates the mystery even further. It begs the question, is there something uniquely active about the ionospheric region above the pyramids? Researchers from the Chinese Academy of Sciences suggest that the low-latitude long-range ionospheric radar Successful detection of the bubble could be a game-changer for space weather monitoring. The implications go beyond academic interest. Plasma bubbles can cause severe disruptions to GPS systems, communication satellites, and even military radar. Forecasting their location, size, and timing could help mitigate these issues, especially in equatorial regions where they are more likely to occur. The ability to monitor these bubbles from such extreme distances means that a global network of similar radars could soon be capable of observing the ionosphere in real time, potentially allowing for forecasts akin to meteorological weather predictions. The researchers behind the project envision a network of three to four over-the-horizon radar stations placed strategically across low latitudes. Such a system could track these plasma bubbles globally and offer predictive capabilities previously thought to be out of reach, but with such advanced surveillance comes renewed interest in what else might be detectable, particularly in regions long associated with mysteries and ancient mysteries. The pyramids of Giza have always held a special fascination for both historians and theorists alike. Built thousands of years ago with stunning precision, the pyramids remain the subject of debate and speculation, from theories about advanced ancient civilizations to more recent discussions about their potential role in harnessing or interacting with energy fields. The detection of a plasma bubble, 
an energetic atmospheric event, adds a strange new layer to these long-standing curiosities. Could the pyramids themselves, massive and geometrically aligned, have any influence on the formation or visibility of these ionospheric bubbles? While no concrete scientific evidence supports this theory, the juxtaposition of cutting-edge technological observations and ancient monuments continues to fuel the imagination. It is this intersection of the ancient and the modern that gives this discovery its compelling narrative. In a world where mysteries are often dismissed or rationalized, the detection of a powerful atmospheric anomaly over one of the most iconic sites in human history invites questions as much as it offers answers. Moreover, this event underlines the importance of global cooperation in understanding the Earth's atmospheric and space environments. While the observation was made by Chinese scientists, the implications affect all nations. Space weather is a global phenomenon, and tools like the low-latitude long-range ionospheric radar could become part of a larger collaborative framework for monitoring and predicting atmospheric conditions. As these systems become more refined, their utility will extend into everyday technologies, including aviation, navigation, and satellite communications. But for now, what remains is the lingering mystery of the Giza plasma bubble. It is one of those rare scientific events that manage to bridge the gap between empirical data and human wonder. Though it may be explained by ionospheric physics, its location and timing make it part of a broader tapestry of recent discoveries that defy easy categorization. In the end, what makes this event so captivating is not merely the detection of a plasma bubble, it is the story of convergence. A convergence of ancient architecture, atmospheric science, and cutting-edge technology. A convergence of curiosity that spans cultures, disciplines, and even eras. In an age driven by data and logic, sometimes it is the unexplained that keeps the spirit of discovery alive. Whether this event stands alone or becomes the first of many revelations to come from an increasingly observable world remains to be seen, but the skies above Giza, already steeped in history and mystery, have now become a theatre for space weather phenomena, captured by distant instruments scanning the heavens and whispering back secrets yet to be fully understood. Scientists detect mysterious heat anomalies in the pyramids. The Great Pyramid of Egypt, also known as the Pyramid of Khufu or Cheops, has stood as one of the world's greatest architectural mysteries for more than 4,500 years. Though extensively studied and explored, it continues to yield secrets, and the most recent scientific endeavor has unveiled a discovery that has reignited global curiosity. A team of international researchers utilizing powerful scanning technology has detected unusual thermal anomalies within the Great Pyramid, particularly on its eastern side raising the tantalizing possibility of hidden chambers or unexplored features within the ancient monument. This unprecedented investigation is part of the ambitious Scan Pyramids project, a collaboration involving scientists from Egypt, Canada, France and Japan. The initiative combines cutting-edge non-invasive technologies, including infrared thermography and cosmic ray muon radiography, to peer inside the solid stone structures without causing damage. The ultimate goal is to uncover unknown cavities, passageways, or construction methods used by the ancient Egyptians. As the technology advances, so too does the depth and precision with which the internal structure of these pyramids can be explored. During one of the earliest stages of the Scan Pyramids mission, researchers performed a thermal survey of the Khufu Pyramid's eastern face. While subtle differences in surface temperature are normal due to environmental factors and variations in the stone, the team discovered something unexpected. Instead of the usual temperature differentials of less than half a degree Celsius between neighboring blocks, one section of the eastern base displayed a temperature difference of up to 6 degrees. This is an enormous variation in thermographic terms and suggests that something fundamentally different lies behind or within that section of the pyramid wall. Infrared thermography works by detecting variations in heat radiation, allowing scientists to visualize temperature patterns across a surface. These patterns can indicate what lies behind that surface. When used on massive stone structures like the Great Pyramid, it helps identify voids, cracks, or other architectural anomalies hidden from view. In the case of the Khufu Pyramid, the anomaly is not only unusually warm, but is also confined to a specific set of blocks, suggesting the presence of a cavity an undiscovered chamber, or differing construction material behind the façade. 
The significance of the anomaly's location cannot be overstated. According to Egyptologist Beth Ann Judas, the eastern side of the Great Pyramid has long held symbolic and functional importance in ancient Egyptian culture. This side also aligns with religious structures associated with the solar cult of the god Ra, who is believed to travel across the sky during the day and descend into the underworld at night. The pyramid itself, designed to connect the pharaoh with the divine, may have incorporated intentional symbolic elements on this eastern face. The newfound heat anomaly could, therefore, be tied not just to structural engineering, but also to spiritual or ritual significance. The scientific community has approached the discovery with both excitement and caution. Mehdi Tayubi, one of the lead researchers on the project, emphasized that multiple hypotheses exist regarding the anomaly, but no conclusions will be drawn until further investigations are completed. The team plans to build thermal models and conduct extended surveys to explore the possibilities. The anomaly could represent a hidden corridor, an architectural feature meant to relieve structural pressure, or even an undiscovered chamber. What makes it all the more intriguing is that this heat anomaly echoes other mysterious findings within the same pyramid, including previously detected voids in upper sections that remain unexplained. The thermal imaging is being complemented by muon tomography, a technique that uses cosmic ray muons to map internal density differences in large structures. Muons are subatomic particles produced when cosmic rays interact with the Earth's atmosphere, and they can penetrate stone structures with ease. By placing detectors inside or near the pyramid, researchers can measure the way these particles are absorbed or deflected by the structure's internal components. Areas of lower density, such as hidden chambers, will allow more muons to pass through, while solid stone absorbs or blocks them. When combined with the thermal results, muon tomography could provide a three-dimensional map of what lies behind the anomalous heat signature. This latest discovery is not occurring in isolation. Recent years have seen a renewed focus on the pyramids of Giza, particularly Khufu's pyramid. Previous surveys have revealed hidden voids near the so-called Grand Gallery, mysterious electromagnetic anomalies, and even unexplained materials found in sealed shafts. All of this has prompted renewed discussions about the true nature of the pyramid, the construction methods employed by its builders, and the possibility that significant elements remain undiscovered within its limestone core.